what's the motherfucking deal, YouTube? This your boy, Coach Dante, in the motherfucking building with you guys. Please comment, like, and subscribe on this video, man. I really appreciate you guys for supporting the channel. I really appreciate you guys for always tuning in to the live streams. Shout out to the Spotlight Sports Network. Shout out to everybody um, that's a part of the Spotlight uh, Sports Network. Shout out to everybody, man. Merry Christmas Eve to you guys. Hope you guys having a fine um, Christmas Eve. Can't wait to Christmas tomorrow. We got a lot of games coming up on to uh, tomorrow. NBA slate of games. So we're, uh, we're going to shout out to uh, everybody, man. So let's get right into the video. So we're going to go with uh, the top. This video has been recommended by my uh, guy, uh, Coach Spotlight, uh, from the Spotlight Sports Network. Shout out to him. Shout out to uh, everybody that support the channel. So we're gonna what we're gonna do. Big Ben. Everybody know Big Ben Roethlisberger is gonna be out after this year, out of Pittsburgh this year. So we're gonna go with the top five quarterback prospects that could that the Steelers could consider taking. After uh, letting ben, uh, Big Ben said he's gonna go into retirement, or consider he said he won't, he will not play for the, that will be his last year for Pittsburgh. So other than that, uh, let's get right into it. Uh, so number one, uh, I got Kenny Pickett. Uh, obviously the uh, the quarterback out of Pittsburgh who had a great season, who had a great season this year. Uh, Kenny Pickett uh, can uh, make all the throws. Can make all the throws. He's a very good quarterback. Um, Pittsburgh, the Pittsburgh Panthers definitely, definitely, uh, can, can, uh, def, definitely is in. The, I think they're in the New Year's Six Bowl game. Uh, they defeated a, a pretty much a good, a lot of good teams. I think they, they defeated Clemson on the year. Kenny Pickett was a top three Heisman uh, quarterback, top three Heisman uh, quarterback this year. So. Kenny Pickett could be number one, and plus he played at Pittsburgh, so he's going to be right at home for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Number two, I'm going to have uh, Malik Willis uh, out of Liberty, uh, the dual threat quarterback. Basically, he needs to work on his accuracy issues. He's very good at escaping up out of the pocket. He's very good uh, to run zone reads with, and he needs to be around a system that basically that is going to fit his skill set and I think Malik Willis will be a great uh, addition to this uh, Pittsburgh Steelers team, him and Mike Tomlin. So that is uh, quarterback number two. Kenny Pickett is quarterback number one because, like I say, again, he's in Pittsburgh right now. He's lighting it up this season. I think Pittsburgh is in the New Year's Six Bowl already right now. And he's a hometown kid. So right now, Kenny Pickett number one. Got Malik Willis number two. Uh, number three, uh, you got uh, you got uh, you got Desmond Ritter. At number three, at number three, you got uh, De you got that, you got uh, Desmond Ritter at number three, uh, Cincinnati quarterback. I really like this guy. This guy got a nice little accuracy on him. Uh, he's got a um, he's got his team in the national uh, part of the college football playoff right now. Um, I'm just I just really like uh, Desmond Ritter's game. I like his accuracy. Uh, he's mobile to some degree. He can escape up out of the pocket. He's a very good leader. Um, and he's one of the reasons why the um, Bearcats are where they are right now, and they uh, may have a uh, they may have a chance to beat Alabama in the college football playoff. Number three is Desmond Ritter. Number four, we got uh, Matt Corral from um, Ole Miss. Ole Miss is a, uh, he's a very good quarterback, very mobile, uh, can throw, make all the throws, uh, great size, uh, great accuracy. Uh, all of these quarterbacks are gonna come, gonna come in capable backups, but these quarterbacks that can start right away from Pittsburgh. It depends on what Pittsburgh do in free agency. So Matt Corral will be number number four, and number five is Sam Howell for uh the quarterback from um uh oh, North Carolina. Uh, he started off the year uh very uh struggling. Um, he was a he was a top one. I think he was a, a top ten prospect coming into this uh, draft this year, but he fell off the face of the map. Uh, North Carolina, I believe they went six and six this year. Um, so he had some ups and downs, some inconsistencies, some accuracy issues. Uh, but he can uh, show he shows a lot. Also shows a lot of flashes of what he can do. So, uh, like I say, man, these are the top five uh, quarterback prospect quarterbacks that the Steelers could consider taking. In the draft uh, this year, uh, if when Ben Roethlisberger leave uh, Pittsburgh right now, so 
Uh, comment, like, and subscribe, guys, what y'all think about this list. If y'all got the list uh, turned around or if y'all disagree, that's fine with me. You know, I don't I don't care. It's, everybody has an opinion. But uh, Kenny Pickett is number one. He's a hometown kid. He's a hometown kid. Uh, number two will be Malik Willis. Number three, Desmond Ritter. Uh, number four. Uh, I forgot who I said number four. Uh, Matt Corral is number four. And we got Sam Howell. So that's the end of the video, guys. Comment, like, and subscribe on this video, guys. Uh, shout out to Spotlight Sports Network. And wish you guys a Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas Eve. Shout out to your boy, Coach Dante. I'm out. Much love. Peace.